right up here. Need water, man. Grab one of those waters in the bag. Uh, so we're uh almost there but not quite still you just need to rest because it, it it doesn't look like it on video maybe it does i haven't this is it this is live but it's it's at least a 20 percent incline yeah it's up there Yeah? All right, let's go. Uh. <laughs> oh, there is a morning. Well, You decided to disregard that. What did you say? That's you right there. <laughs> Death of a curse. Well, that's a possible version of you. See how the rocks are falling and you're saying, Nyah, yeah. This is fat I was real nervous for the first part, but once I got up to the base of the tree, I was good. That is a long way down. You got lucky. You got so lucky. That was a forest ranger right there that just passed us. This is probably what people did before they fell. Yeah, that's probably where people went before they fell down to their death. Because a few people have fallen and, and died. I'm pretty sure that's where people like tried to get a picture and stuff and ended up falling. You know, not that the green part is any warning. I sure death right there. But I was thinking we could go up there. What are you thinking? Yeah. Remember, you go up that way or that way? Like, take these rock paths up that way and then up the rock and up? Sure. Yeah? Sure. I'm going uh, up here, man, because... That's definitely not the way that I was thinking. Yeah, I know. <laughs> well, we might as well make our own stack, man. We made it. Uh. Uh. 
Whoa! I messed up with that because I just started tossing little rocks right there. <laughs> oh! Oh! No! Not allowed! Uh, almost there. What are you doing? So, although nature is violent and cruel and exhausting, something as simple as water, which we consume every day, shapes out something so amazing. Truly is spectacular, which is the simpler, simplest of elements, such a stable element, and it does something so unstable truth because let me put it to you this way stability is not at the top of that waterfall you stand up there and you're for sure going uh i would say that's probably close to 90 feet maybe a little bit more absolute death yeah you fall down that at, at any at either of those two points up there and you are definitely uh sleeping with the metaphorical fishes This much rock suspended over nothing. At any given moment, this whole entire thing could fracture and cause some damage. Don't tease me. Yeah, I could see where you get messed up, slide down there, ch -ch 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 face. Ha! Ah! Mm. Jump rock. Hey, cheers. I want to do that devil's devil's cliff or devil's edge run 
Um, it's supposed to be the most dangerous one. It goes from just over 2,000 feet to 11,000 feet. Are we absolutely doing it? At some point. We're at some point doing that, so stay tuned. Um, I want to get a couple more hikes in just so I can strengthen my, my thigh muscles and kind of uh, get a little bit more cardio in because it is, it is a steep hike. I won't be carrying this pack because it will be slowing me uh, down a lot and pulling me back. We're so. going to have to get one of those small ones. Yeah, I'm going to get a, just a simple camelback uh, backpack just so I can carry my water and stuff. But yeah, there's people way up there. You barely see them through the mist though. Yeah. Look at all that fog rolling through. Oh, that just made me dizzy. <laughs> I look too far up in the air. Whoa. Yeah, I do sometimes too. If I look up too far, I get dizzy. Like if this was just straight drop and no slope, I might feel that way. Dizzy, yeah. I get dizzy like that, but looking straight up while I'm standing on an edge is worse. So. Someone lost the visor, someone gave up. Someone gave up on that late 90s trend. About time. Why do you leave it here though? I don't know. Better than graffiti, I guess? <laughs>